Hey everyone, and we're back. My name is Miss Scarlet Hinniger, and we are playing some Mass Effect 3. Dun dun dun! Anybody for me to talk to over here? How about over here? How about you? Was the Volus ambassador here earlier? Yes, he was, Commander. Where at? I need in. Spectre business. I'll unlock the office when you're ready. How about now? <laughs> like, how about this very second? Hello? Wait. Isn't this where the Hanar was? This looks like where the Hanar was, except a little bit brighter. Entry one. I did not touch anything there. I just waved my hand. That's because you were actually doing some good in the galaxy before. Has that changed? How many colonies would be gone if we hadn't taken action against the Collectors? Too many. But Wait a minute. Must continue Cerberus? In order to end the war. That makes no we sense. We understand it took a lot for you to reach out to Cerberus, Ambassador Korlak. We ask that you trust us a little longer. Yeah, never trust Cerberus. Ever. You people are monsters. Ambassador, please. Hundreds dead. Udina betraying the council. I should have cut ties with you ages ago. Why did they have ties and to a bullet? Now, the risks you took by passing information to Cerberus, it's left you in an interesting position. And now they're blackmailing him. If you sever contact, we can't protect you from the consequences. I don't. I have no time for this. We'll speak again. Have a good day, Ambassador Korlak. Okay. <sighs> The Turians think I'm still working for Cerberus. They've put a price on my head. Have they now? I can't go to CSEC, but Cerberus has plans. An entire Turian colony rests on my life. That's bad. That's not. If anyone finds this, I hid a tracking receiver in the office suite beside the human embassies. Well, at least he's trying to help out now. After giving Cerberus intel, like a scrub. He's dead now. <laughs> Oops. Damn, Cerberus has them everywhere nowadays. Zai? You're gonna go on about them all night. Just get the car up here quick. Little bastard's even heavier than he looks. Zaid? <laughs> Zaid? Oh, right. They put a bounty on his head, so Zaid went to collect it. <laughs> I was wondering when Zaid was gonna come up again. Okay, where's the thing? Where's the thing? There it is. I'm just gonna take that. Yeah. Good thing I actually know exactly where I'm going with this. Because I've played this quest before. How long till we killed Kolak? What are you doing, Zaid? Was beginning to think you weren't interested in the money. Oh, come on, it's Zaid. Because Korlak worked for Cerberus. What'd they do to you? About that. None of your goddamn business. He waking up. This is Commander Shepard. Can you hear me? <sighs> yes. Yes, I can hear you. Tell me where you are. And I'll go and help. Uh, we're still near the Presidium. How, we, how does Zaid not hear him? Check Selkish arms when they realize I'm missing. They won't give a damn when they realize you sold them out to Cerberus. Zaid. Cerberus is planning to attack a colony that. Stay calm. Help's coming. And I'm not running for some reason. I'm just nonchalantly waltzing into the elevator instead of going, "Oh crap!" and bolting. Then again, I guess I, I guess bolting wouldn't be such a good idea because then everyone would see me running and it would draw attention, and then there would be a firefight, and then there'd be guns blazing, and somebody's gonna get shot in the ass. Somebody always gets shot in the ass. It's just how science works. And I'm yet again stalling for time because loading screen. But we get to see Zaid again and his wonderfully scarred face and gruff demeanor. He is he would be the best gruff grandpa ever. Zaid is now grandpa. No, Zaid used to work for Cerberus. Ask him why he's here. Why? Why go after your old employer, Zaid? Hmm. I know my name all of a sudden. Because magic? Good question. Just give me a minute. 
Like, how do you know his name? Uh, Magic? I'm here to help. Let me in. Damn. Wrong door. Balls. We need you alive to stop Cerberus. Cerberus is after a Turian colony. Kill me, and they get it. Yes, Don't I need to help. Shepard's investigating. She's a recent acquaintance. Yes, yes. How recent? Just now. Very. <laughs> Very recent. Alright, I'm listening. Alright, I'm listening. Hi, Saeed. Well then. There's a Krogan hey, on the floor. Zaid. Hi, honey. Shepard. Glad I wasn't just making an ass of myself over a hunch. No problem, bro. Undisciplined bastards. This is what I get for signing up at the last minute. Where's Korlak? Well, maybe you should get yourself some better marks. I'm here, Commander. I... You're in a lot of trouble. <laughs> you saved my life. I almost died because the Turians thought I was still with Cerberus. Did those marks hurt you? A little. I'm fine. They wanted me alive until the fees were delivered for my capture. They didn't care about what I had to say. Okay. You kept mentioning a colony in your message. Information on a Turian planet's defense system. They'll strike soon. That would be bad. Let's not. But if I tell you which planet they're attacking, Cerberus will know I turned traitor. I will kill you, you already so badly. People. We saved your life. Tell us what planet you put in danger. I can offer a bargain. The Volus bombing fleet. In tactical terms, it's worth far more than a colony. I don't care. You're or going you to give, give me both. Exactly, you can give me both. You can warn the Turians there'll be an attack, Commander. That should be general enough to ward off suspicion. No! Beat him, Zaid. You're better than this. You tried to do the right thing before. It failed because you trusted the wrong people. Now here's your chance to make up for it. You're giving us Volus support, and you're going to help us make Cerberus pay for using you. Or we're going to shoot you between the eyes. Is what I would have added, but... I can't. I'm a little renegade. You can. Yes, you can. Most of everyone's time trying to appeal to our Volus's better nature, Shepard. Shut up, Zaid. Shut up, Grandpa. Aphis. The colony's name is Aphis. Cerberus wants its shipyards. And the bombing fleet? Yes, it's yours, Commander. Good! Now I don't have to play one between I'll the eyes. I'll speak with Citadel Security about this... incident. You have my thanks. No problem. Please leave. Took him long enough to spit that out. Yep. Zaid, what are you doing here? Later. C6 on their way. Won't be too pleased with the mess we left them. So like, I'll talk to you later. Catch up Bye. Catch up the docks if you like. Now I have to go back to the docks. Okay. Two of the docks. Yay, we got a Volus bombing fleet. Yay. Yay, fleet. Poof. <laughs> Uh, docks. One moment, please. The last episode and this episode are just going to all be Citadel. These should just be the collective Citadel episodes. Not counting the stuff that I did for the Citadel DLC. But whatever. I don't know why loading screens just make me do this. Probably because I can't stand still for very long. I have to do something. And I have a camera that is watching me, and it feels awkward not to be doing things at all times. <sighs> so how you all doing? <laughs> Every single time I ask how you guys are doing, the loading stops. She just always asks how you guys are doing. Saeed? Where you at, bro? Wrong button. That one? No. Oh, I thought I had a map button. Never mind. I'll go hold C7. Okay, he's right down there. Good. Saeed! Honey buns! Grandpa! What the hell How you doing? Hey! Nothing. 
Wondered if you'd show up, Sherpin. Sup? Figured you'd be too busy recruiting goddamn armies for this war you're in charge of. Well, you're a one-man army, so... You want to help? You help? That, I've seen footage of what happened on Earth. Then you should help. Tell you what. I'll see if some old contacts of mine are still around. I'm okay with Can't this. Can't promise you anything, but if enough of them are still breathing, I can lend a hand. Still okay with this. Who are those people you were with? Bunch of mercs from Omega. Signed on with them when I heard they were making a hit on Cerberus. Just hand this. Studied the job <laughs> longer. Just stretch it. <laughs> Who are those people you were with? A oh. bunch of mercs from Omega. Okay. Bye, Saeed. See you later. Yeah, probably ha should have, should have, could have, would have, didn't, at all. Is there a, is there a, a thing? One of those things, rapid transit things somewhere, maybe, possibly. There probably is somewhere. It just can't be asked. Gone. Do do do. Status recognized. One moment, please. So then we go to the docks, and then we can go to the Sunset Strip. And Sunset? Silver Sun? S something with an S. And go have some fun times with everybody there. And I can't remember who they all were. This is just gonna be loading screen after loading screen. Oh, I got an idea. Hey, how you guys doing? Oh my god. Now <laughs> arriving at docking bay. By the goddess, it works. <laughs> Silver sun strip. It's like every time I just go. So how you guys doing? Okay, it didn't work that time. But no, seriously. I've been doing good. Working on college, taking classes. College is good, college is fun. Do it if you can do it. If you can't, when you do something else, that's fine too, but I want to be a computer science major, I want to make video games, I want to be a part of gaming, and the culture, and everything else, and so, computer science. Even though what I actually want to do is writing for video games, like writing and concept art, but I figure I love computers and I like coding anyway, so I might as well learn that as well, and then I can do some things by myself. Purchase party supplies. Not yet. Purchase party supplies when I'm gosh darn ready. Now what's this place? Okay. I don't think I actually did anything in the Armax Arena. At least I don't remember doing anything in the Armax Arena. Hello? Armax VI. Hello, Commander Shepard. Hi. Welcome to the Armax Arsenal Arena. Okay. Armax Arsenal and the Citadel Tourist and Visitor Board have registered you for a copy. Yeah, I don't care. Remember to redeem your way Is Jack here? Jack? Blast of six partners in crime. Oh dear. What's this? Tokens. Tokens. I don't think I've ever actually done this. Hello? Open the email seven news in Armor Serena and fans. The next match will be starting soon. Good luck to the competitors. Okay. Wait a minute! I can unlock Jack and Grunt and Rex? And Zaid and Samara and Kasumi and Jay- <gasps> We're gonna have to have an episode that's just this. Now how do I get out of this? Wait, can I- I, I, I want to get out of this! Let me out! Wingman. The next match will be starting soon. Um, Good luck to the competitors. ED. 
Garrus. What am I doing? Let's go against Cerberus, I guess. Random. The next match will be starting soon. Enjoy the show. I don't wanna. I'm leaving. We can have an episode or two of the Armax area if that's what you guys want to see. If you guys want to see some of that, if you want me to try to unlock Jack and Kasumi and everybody else, let me know and I'll do so. But arenas, I only really do them if people want me to do them. I honestly, and any of my other playthroughs, I've never done anything in the Armax arena unless it was, you know, something with Jack or something. I don't want to be a new player. I know there's some people I need to met, meet up with, but I can't remember where. Anybody in here? Good Whee! luck and good evening. Okay. Can you let me in? Please. How about you let me in? Thank you. So who's this patriarch person you keep going on about? Well, I have no have idea. Heard of patriarch? Enthusiastic guest. I swear there were some people I needed to meet here. Live Varen race starts in five minutes. Place your bet. Live Varen. Okay, it's not here. Maybe I should just go to the house no and table. look. Fair warning. I'm not a hustler. How dare you? Okay, obviously there's nobody in the casino, so I'm just gonna. That's nice. I don't like gambling. I've never been much of a gambler. I only gamble with my life, never my money. Let me out. Let me out. These are really crappy doors. They don't open automatically. Even automatic doors in the real world open automatically. Okay, what's this place? It's a place. Somebody I can have a chat with? I know I know there's somebody. Good evening, Castle Arcade. Take that. Okay, is I know that we have something here with Zaid, I just don't know if we can tell reports on Oh, trainer! Ha! Huh, I knew there was something. And I think we also have to meet with Joker? I can't remember. There she is! Is she gonna beat me at chess again? <laughs> Grrr. Grrr. That's a hell of a little cruiser! Why does that shock you? How's that supposed to shock you? Brilliant endgame. Excellent use of the Bay Lucian Gambit. Is Bay Lucian Gambit? Space chess? It's called Kepesh Yakshi, Blade of the Night Winds. The Asari have played it since. We were supposed to meet for lunch. Yes. I'm so sorry. Yes, I we were a trainer. I, I, I thought I'd be eliminated in the first few rounds. And then you won! Oh, don't worry. You'll be free to join your friend in 20 moves or fewer. Oh, that's a challenge. To Sousa. <laughs> what? Trainer, <laughs> would you like to just give me your frigates now? I always take them sooner or later. Arrival oh, enters the arena. She's knocked me out of four tournaments. Do it. Do it. Specialist. Commander. Kick her ass. <laughs> Roger that. Kick her ass. <laughs> I love this zoom in. That's beautiful! That's beautiful! Oh, that's beautiful. Kick her ass. Kick her ass. Do it. Damn it. Ah! You got this, so trainer. Much for your frigate. Neural feedback. It disincentivizes sacrificing pieces casually. That's silly. You got this, honey. 
a few more centuries, trainer, and you might be a challenge. Oh, shut you your must face! You not have that much to time Susan. to practice now, living on that warship. My people have more respect for the great Kick thinkers. <laughs> I'm able to live quite comfortably teaching Asari Maidens tactics and strategy through this game. So your Shush. job is playing, playing games? games? Hey, my job's playing games! students in strategic <laughs> and tactical simulations. Yes. Your job is Specialist games. Specialist trainer here personally saved Grissom Academy. More than a dozen students owe her their lives. I'm sure she's a wonderful serviceman. But she just lost her last frigate. No, she didn't. I traded her last frigate, actually, for your homeworld. Do it. Do it. You got this, honey. You got this. You got this. You got this. Owned. <gasps> what kind of game is this that shot at you? Commander. And I apologize again for missing lunch. All for a good cause, trainer. Ass. Carry on. No problem, honey buns. Don't worry about it. Don't even worry about it. <laughs> the Citadel is so derpy. It's the best thing ever. Is there anything I gotta do up here? How about over here? You go right in front good of the doors. Oh. Oh, I see. It's a trap. What are you it's a tarp. It's a tarp. Okay. Flashing. What will you win? Um... That thing. Great. Congratulations! You can win! Music track for apartments! <laughs> okay! Sure, why not? I mean, I know we have to beat Zaid there eventually, but... No, pretty much. King of the castle! Cool, I earned a trophy! I don't know... Why oh, I earned though. a trophy or what I did to earn said trophy, so but I got one. More Shakespeare from you? Actually, I'm mounting a production of Macbeth with a new Krogan talent as the lead. He brings uh, Macbeth with a Krogan? To the stage that emphasizes nope, the gone. Actions of his character. <laughs> I'm not even touching that. I wouldn't touch that with a ten foot pole. It didn't help that we had some brutal yeah, It's a bolus. But even then, we had to disable It's a dude. Hi, sir. Someone requested my presence concerning an incident with a Krogan. Oh, great. I like know where this, this is going. Grunt. Little bro. Since... Uh, just think about it. He is my little brother. We're just a big old family here in Mass Effect. Grunt. So, Grunt. Anything you want to tell me about? Uh, this clown wants to take me to lockup. Figured I'd give you a call. Straighten this out. What did you do? Commander Shepard, I apologize for the intrusion. This Krogan insisted we contact you. It's okay. I vouch for him. I'll sign any paperwork you have, officer. What did you do? Yes, ma'am. Grunt, what did you do? What happened? <laughs> what I happened? Know. Drank a bit, left the hospital. Broke a few windows. Grunt! But you were in that hospital recovering from the rack knife counter. counter. Yeah. Didn't feel like sticking around. Most people stick around long enough to, you know, heal. heal. Most people aren't me. Damn it, Grunt! And why is CSEC here? Guess they're precious about some broken glass. Broken glass? Before I sign you out. Everybody walked away from this in one piece, right? You didn't kill anybody. Sure, yeah, everybody's fine. Hospital seen better days, though. Damn it, Grunt! <laughs> right. Tell me about the windows. A couple of squad mates broke me out for my birthday. Tried okay. lowering me down the side of the building on a rope. Okay. Yeah, it didn't work out. <laughs> it's your birthday? No, I'm tank bread, remember? Anyway, we got some pictures on the Krogan Memorial. In the Presidium? Oh, God! <laughs> yeah. When c -Sec got there, they were mad. Or maybe they were mad about their car being on fire. I can't <laughs> Their remember. car was on fire? Why was it on fire? I threw my bottle of ring call at it. Pretty strong stuff. It went up like a bonfire. Grunt, what did you do to my graphics? The c -Sec guys jumped out. 
primed. And I figured they didn't want it, so I took it. You stole a Z-Z car? We didn't get very far before they shut us down. Sprayed us down with riot foam. <laughs> didn't work so well on me. You don't say. Then why is that? Because I was on fire. You know, from the car. You were on fire. Come on, Shepard, keep up. Right. Sorry. So how did they catch you? Got hungry. Bought some noodles. You got hungry and bought some noodles. Grunt. Grunt. You apologized to the nice man for and setting, for setting his, his, car his car on fire. On fire. <laughs> Fine. I'm sorry for setting your car on fire. I feel like mom now. Okay, Grunt's my son. And I won't do it again. He's he's Good. just been downgraded to son status. Now, officer, I can pay for any damages that may have occurred. That's what you've been signing for, Commander. You're lucky, Krogan. Don't let me catch you up here again. You won't. Grunt is now my son. Thank you, officer. He is mine and Garrus' son. Damn it, Grunt. I know so, I'm your mom, but... How were those noodles? Were they good? A little spicy. You wanna go get some more? <laughs> I love you, Grunt. <laughs> <laughs> I love you, Grunt. I love Grunt, too. Well, Shepard is me, so... <laughs> so he jumped out... Well, he fell. But he jumped out of a hospital window, shattering the window. Then he climbed all over some a statue on the Presidium. Then he set a C6 car on fire with a bunch of alcohol. Then he stole the car he set on fire, setting himself on fire in the process. Crashed the car, got hit with riot foam, broke out of the riot foam, still on fire. And then I went and got some noodles. God damn it, Grunt. <laughs> God damn it, Grunt. God damn it, Grunt. <laughs> I just don't see what the point is. Okay, then let's go back to the Normandy. Yes. We're gonna go back to the Normandy. Because we just had an adventure. <laughs> and I need to check my personal messages to make sure that we have nothing else to go do on the Citadel right now. We might have Zaid to go see. We might have some more letters to read. Or I could just go say hi to Arya and we could do Omega. Or I could do Leviathan. Should I do Leviathan now? Or should I do Omega now? Commander, Dr. Chuck was sent word that she'd like to speak with you down in the med bay. Okay. I guess that makes that decision, but we're probably going to do Omega first. Liara. Liara wants to work. Okay, that was... Yeah, we've already done that one. Have fun in games. Yeah, I don't think that happened. Thank you. Meet me in purgatory. Don't make me wait too long. Okay, we've already done that one. We've done that one. Done that one. Done that one. Oh, wait a minute! I still have to go turn that thing on for Miranda. Oops. I actually went all the way over there, too. Gosh darn it, Napa. Sure, leave. Jeff. Okay. We will, um... Um... In the next video, I will have gone to do the thing in the Spectre Requisition terminal -y place, and we will go talk to Chocolates and possibly get started on the Omega DLC. My name is Miss Scarlet Teenager, and I am playing some Mass Effect 3. I'll see you all in the next video.